And the police in Kinsampo have arrested 16 suspects in connection with various crimes, including armed robbery, murder, and motorbike thefts in the town. In an interview with Joy News, Divisional Police Commander ACP Joseph Entry Jew indicated that the arrest forms part of the police fight against armed robbery and general crime within the area. The suspects, who are currently in custody, include 12 suspected armed robbers, two motorcycle syndicates, two cattle thieves, and three more who are standing trial on a murder case. Join News, Anas Sabit has more in the following report. This year, you have been able to have uh, about six of the robbers who have been jailed 15 years each. They are now serving their prison sentence in uh, Sunyani. Over the years, there has been an increase in the number of armed robbery cases along the Tichiman, Kintampo, and Bupe stretch. Traders who visit the Bupe market are kept in a state of fear whenever they seek to embark on their usual business trips. They are being on our highways and our neighboring towns or uh, villages, especially on the stretch from Kintampo to Bupe. What they have been doing is that either day or night, they will be on the road. What we have noticed is that they also have informants, so any time that they see or they hear that people are committing on the road from uh, Bupe market, they also trade them and then come and rob them. So aside the neighboring villages to the market women or passengers, they will go there and rob them. You see, that place is far from the police station. But in an attempt to fight against crime along this route, the Kintampo Divisional Police Command has intensified its patrol over the past four months. And through this period, 12 suspected armed robbers are currently in police custody standing trial. ACP Joseph Antri Jao is the Kintampo Divisional Police Commander. Three or four months now, there have been robberies on our highways and I'll be able to arrest about 12 of them. I think you've seen them uh, taking photographs of them. The most recent one is the three guys who were arrested from Kunsu, of who they are also within us now. So we are having about, presently we are having about 12 of them uh, on remand. According to the police, 90% of these suspects are nomadic herdsmen. ACP Anchi Jau added that cattle owners do not do enough checks on people they employ, hence the increase in robberies committed by nomadic herdsmen. Uh, from these are robberies, about 90% of them they are all Fulani people. Why Fulani people? Simply because the owners of the cattle. They, are, they like uh, cheap labor. Anybody who comes to them to tell them I'm, I want a job, they offer him. Whether he's a thief or he's a robber, who know. So that's what is happening. He, however, gave a breakdown of the crimes committed by these suspects in custody. Uh, for murder, murder cases, and there are 12 of them to robbery. Aside, we are arrested about two boys, young boys, who are also syndicate of uh, motorbikes. We are also be sent to court and then uh, they have been remanded. For the Divisional Police Command, the fight against armed robbery cases comes with some challenges. You know, we are between uh, about three separate areas. We are on the right to Bamboy, Bole Bamboy, and then on the north here to Nkuraza, Tebubu area there, and that of uh, Tachima and Wenchi. You know, our catchment area is very vast, with only few police stations. You can talk of only Kadresu and that of Ninonguru. From here to Abasi, it's around uh, 60 kilometers, and there's no police station there. 
He called on the public to assist the police with enough information in order to help fight the menace, adding that the fight would continue till the end. You know, our police, we only deal with information. Aside that we have our informants, uh, the senior should also be able to feel free and give information. If you give us information, that's why we work. Well, my only message is that you can run, but you can't hide. Definitely, time will catch them up. Reporting for joining us, Anas Sabit, Kintampo.